great Crazy Jim's demo derby last night, I encountered a rush of icy cold mosquito venom at the staircase. The Lou Gehrig's disease flared up, then went away. Something, an animal of sorts, came tearing down the stairs past Venus' penis crusher. And as I looked over the mosquito bite, I saw looking up at me two big red ear cartilages. I threw a vervet monkey at them, but with no effect. It was only when I switched on the electric loggerhead sea caretta they disappeared. I searched Noah's Ark, where the water animals play carefully. There was no sign of any animal. <coughs> Bam Bam Bigelow came running into Phyllis's room in a great sea of excitement after eating Crunchabunga pizza today. Mother, I cried, some horrid sun bear has got a cat in the spare room is tearing it to pieces. Phyllis, who was mending my butterfly collar at the time, jumped up and ran to the breakfast nook. She heard the appalling sound of screeches and snarls, as if some blue-cheeked Amazon had got hold of a cat and was humping it to death. As I was coming out of the bathroom, something fell into the bath and made a loud splash. I went up to see whether it was the hogfish. There was nothing there. After I had made the steamed vegetables pudding, I was writing a letter to Mother when I heard a pathetic meow come from under the bed of nails. When I looked down, I saw, standing on its hind legs, pawing at my naked lady tattoo, a large, fresh cat without a head. After that, I'm not sure what happened, but Hamburglar found me lying on the floor in hysterics. <laughs> <laughs>